Greetings to you all, our beloved guests. Welcome to Jibin Forest Recreational Area. Going southwest from the refreshing atmosphere of Taidong City for about 22 kilometers. Passing through Jibin Hot Spring Area, then follow Jibin River going upstream. Drive for about 30 minutes and you'll reach your final destination, Jibin Forest Recreation Area. Jibin Forest Recreational Area covers a total land area of 110 hectares, from 110 meters above sea level to the summit at 650 meters above sea level. Divided into three sections according to natural conditions, namely recreational area, 9 hectares, camping area, 31 hectares, and scenic preservation area, 70 hectares. For over 20 years, Fellow workers of Taidung Forest Area Administrative Department have put all their efforts in building and cultivating what, in 1979, was originally only a nursery garden for trees. Today, it has developed into a countrywide famous ecological scenic spot. Just the place to go for a getaway from the busy city. A tour site great for recreational activities such as mountain climbing, hiking, bird watching, moreover a fabulous place to enjoy forest spa. This recreational area is located in the southeastern part of Taiwan. Latitude equals to Pingdong, which is located at the west side. Throughout the year, the weather there is warm and has high moisture making it a remarkable natural landscape for incubating a rich variety of forest ecosystem resources that mainly consists of a natural broadleaf forest, an evergreen broadleaf second forest, and an artificial economic forest. Hundred-year-old Fiscus benjamina variety benjamina that's scattered in the area are even norm species belonging to the tropical rainforest. The huge aerial roots that structures up the main trunk, soars high and tall, makes them a unique forest ecological scene that can be seen nowhere else. After crossing Luling Rainbow Bridge, the first thing that comes into your sight will be the ticket stand and scenic platform built in log style. As you walk on the broad footway, look underneath the running river water beside the bridge and you'll find a pair of Taiwan Samba, which are regarded as a mascot for Taiwan's forest, welcoming you to our recreational area. Then, step onto the footway made by Joru Bricks, guided by butterflies that cluster around you, and you'll find yourself at the tourist center. This is a white building decorated by totems in traditional Aboriginal style. In the center of the building, you'll see a cylindrical annual corridor, and in the middle of it is a sculpture named Mother Earth, calling our attention for the preservation of Earth. Look up, and you'll see the bright radiating glass roof. Sunlight comes in, shimmering here and there, demonstrating the great wonders of Mother Nature before your eyes. Elegant outdoor coffee seats are set outside the service center, which also serves causal meals to tourists who wish to have something to eat and drink. Multimedia screening rooms show you about 10 minutes of briefing, introducing the beauties of this recreation for the whole year. Going up along the corridor, you'll find the showroom. There, you'll gain general knowledge on the overall forestry ecosystem. And also, you'll find a wide conference room that can be used for a variety of purposes. In the service center, there are also computerized tour guide devices for you to use. You can also ask our staff to escort you and to do the explaining or ask for broadcasting services. Behind the tourist center, over 200 species of flowers and plants were cultivated that can be used for medicines, which makes it a beautiful medicinal botanical garden. Realizing the poetic scene in an ancient Chinese saying that from under a pine I asked the little boy where his teacher had gone. And he answered that he went to gather medicinal herbs in the mountains where the clouds are thick but specific spot unknown. In this garden, you'll be surprised to find out that there are so many plants and flowers that can be used as medicines. Going through the front garden of the service center, 
you'll find yourself in the botanical garden area. In this area, more than 120 species of trees of local and foreign origin are planted. Flowers bloom all seasons, from the treetops to tree trunks and roots, forming an ecosystem of animals and plants with mutual benefits. All kinds of insects live in these trees, with the humming sasadas and singing of birds, making this area a great natural classroom, right inside the forest. You can share your findings in observing raw nature with each other here. In front of Jibin Cottage, a group of rare and precious species of Cycus titungendus is planted. They are plants belonging to a special prehistoric and ancient species, which makes them living fossils good for doing research on the landscape change of Taiwan. In front of this group of Cycus titungendus, there's a little pond of life water. Purple-blue lotus blooms within, swimming fishes contrasted by the reflection of Araucaria heterophylla make it a small but magnificent scene. Often, little white egrets are also attracted to this place and lingered on, forgetting to return. Going down along the mountainside, you'll see a stairway-like creek massage footpath located in the shade of the forest where the water comes from the mountain. In the cool mountain spring, walk barefoot on the stones and all your tiredness will be gone. Enjoy the foot massage to relax your body and mind. No matter whether you're male or female, old or young, we're sure that you will all enjoy this rare chance of taking a cool forest spa. There's also a pavilion surrounded by greenery, and beside it is an open grass plaza of 1,200 square meters, with ladder-like watching stands great for holding large-scale outdoor activities. Along the mountain spring flowing down from Creek Massage Footpath, on the mountainside a water-gathering area outdoor demonstrative classroom was built to educate and promote the concept of land and water preservation. Here, you can see models of different types of preservation constructions in miniature size, gaining a deeper knowledge on both the construction and its functions. Walking further down from the demonstrative classroom alongside Jibin River, you'll come to the picnic area, which beneath the shades of Fraxinus Formosana and Fraxinus Formosana, in this forest land, you'll find tables and stools made out of stone and sheltering to keep you out of the rain. A fresh spring flows down from the flowing water massage area straight into Jibin River. At the same time, add the sizzling sound of running water and lively reflections to the tall forest trees. Here, you can also watch birds of water-liking nature, such as the pied wagtail, yellow wagtail, Plumbius water redstart, Taiwan whistling thrush, little egret, flying endlessly above the clear river water. Guangling Drawbridge, with a length of over 80 meters, is located in this area. With lulling Rainbow Bridge in the distance, the two bridges form two bows of rainbow above the river, a favorite spot for tourists to take pictures. Entering from the entrance at the tourist center, then going through Jibin Resort, flowing water massage footway down the picnic area, then going out from the Guangling Drawbridge. This footway is the smoothest of the three scenic footways located in the recreational area, which is the most common path taken by tourists. But if you only walk this one footway, then you'll miss a lot of marvelous scenes. If you wish to enjoy the special scenic features of this entire recreational area, then you must walk through all three footways. You'll find so much that we're sure that you'll not regret coming here. A green shower trail is located at the mid-slope of the mountain. The whole length of this footway is 1,800 meters going upwards from the foot massage area. As you climb up the mountain, you'll see the waterfalls located in the river valley with swift currents splashing out splendid water sprays as they hit the rocks. This is the place with the most oxygen in Anyan. Coming to the waterfalls, be sure to take deep breaths. Take in a rich amount of air vitamins to refresh yourself. 
and feel healthy all the way back home as you leave. Passing the waterfalls hiking more upward, you'll find yourself in the forest that consists of a variety of broadleaf. Take a stroll inside this forest and you'll hear birds singing and treetops everywhere around you. Squirrels also run between chasing and playing with each other. Groups of Taiwanese macaques sometimes can be discovered here, and you'll see them eating flower shoots and fruits from the trees. The Monkey King and Mother Monkeys holding little monkeys in their arms are expert jumpers in these woods. When seeing these mischievous characters of the woods, be sure to refrain yourself from shouting out loudly in excitement so as not to scare them and disrupt their free life in this forest. Passing through the intersection with Brave Man's Slope, the footway enters a man-made forest that consists of Fraxinus formosana and Suetinia macrophylla. Totally different scenery from the natural forest. Under Suetiana macrophylla, you'll be surrounded by a strong, thick, and energetic tree trunks. It's so amazing that you cannot help but praise the greatness of life force in the forest. The beginning of Brave Man's Slope is in the forest beside the tourist center, climbing vertically upwards for 1,500 meters. Total length of 320 meters on the mountainside with 792 stair steps. As the inclination is high and precipitous, climbing vertically up and down challenges both our physical strength and endurance. Pick up your courage and go up these stair steps. There's a platform for looking into the distance under thousands of huge Ficus Benjamina variety Benjamina trunks. Standing on this platform, you'll find yourself looking at a borderless scene. Behind these thousand trunks grow a gigantic climber that looks like a huge snake coiling on a banyan. This is the hundred-year-old huge climbing vine, a very rare scene in the forests of Taiwan. Going further upwards from Brave Man's Slope is Banyan Shaded Trail. The whole length of this footway is 2,100 meters, where on its alongside you'll observe 17 Ficus Benjamina variety Benjamina, with aerial roots forming unique different styles and shapes of their own. This is not only the most precious sight to see in our Jibin Forest Recreational Area, but is also a scene very rare seen elsewhere in forests of Taiwan. But the most convenient beginning spot of this footway is through the entrance of the waterfalls walking upwards. Here are laid steps made out of cross ties. On them you climb up the mountainside. It's not as tiresome as Brave Man's Slope. The first thing that comes to your eyesight is a pavilion for you to enjoy great distant views. Strolling along a number of Ficus Benjamina variety Benjamina as you reach number 10, Climb upwards to the right just for 10 minutes and you'll reach the peak in our recreational area. Here you'll find two stories pavilion called Guanghai Pavilion. Standing on this pavilion watch to the east for mountainous view of Jibin Hot Spring area, rural area of Taidong City and the sky blue Pacific Ocean. The sea melts into the sky and at heights you'll find the world under your feet. Making your trip here worthwhile. Going down the mountain, turn right at number 10 Ficus Benjamina Variety Benjamina and continue downwards will take you to the flat balcony of Brave Men's Slope. Alongside is another area inhabited by Taiwanese macaques. In order to let tourists to have a deeper knowledge of the forest and to develop the concept of wildlife and nature preservation, Forest Area Administrative Department of Taidong has enrolled a staff of volunteers to provide escorting service and ecological explanation to our visitors. Inside the area, there are more than 300 explaining plates which provide rich information for tourists that prefer self-guiding. The scenery in Jiben Forest Recreational Area resembles a tropical rainforest. Originally, there are many Phalambillus variety Formosana parasiting the tree trunks, but they have been plucked by people long ago. For many years, our staff members have worked on the recovery plan of Phalambillus variety Formosana by breeding more than 10,000 seedlings on the tree trunks in our recreation area. Every year at the end of winter and beginning of spring is the blooming season of Phalambillus variety Formosana. 
White flowers contrasted by the green forest resembles white butterflies dancing among the trees. This scene has become a distinguishing feature of our recreation area. Ecological tours are a worldwide trend. Their main purpose is to remind the public of the value of natural wildlife. Touring in a way that fits with the concept of environmental protection in order to decrease the destruction of the Earth's ecosystem. Touring in a recreational area is also an in-depth experience of an ecological tour. Please start by watching small personal details. Don't throw garbage in to spoil the greenery that surrounds you. Pack them up and bring them home with you to dispose of them properly. As our recreational area is of a tropical mountainous nature, the inclination is steep and the damp paths are sometimes slippery. Please watch your step, go slowly and hold on to the railings alongside the footways to ensure your safety. As you approach the riverside and waterfalls, be sure not to stride across the fences to play with water or fish. Follow the warning signs and safety precautions marked on plates in the area. For example, do not leave the footway and wander into the bushes. Please avoid poisonous snakes and wasps. If you don't disturb them, they won't attack you. Do not pick fruits and seeds from trees or bushes to eat, as to avoid poisoning. Do not run, jump on, or shake Guangling Drawbridge. Avoid over 20 persons on the bridge at the same time. Please follow all of these warnings to ensure a safe and happy trip here at a recreational area. The hinterland of Jibin Forest Recreational Area is not very wide, but through our efforts we have made it a very good tour spot for parents and children, friends and families to enjoy themselves. Aside from the forest spas that can refresh and soothe you all and bring you health and joy, and at the same time, we also have an in-depth exploring trip of nature in our area, so you can be friends with Taiwan's macaques, insects, and birds. Gaining knowledge at the same time, recall the love of nature that's hidden deep in each one of you, will be the greatest reap of this trip. Wish you all health and happiness forever!